looks like I got in here just in time. It's starting to sleet outside. Hopefully my fire will stay there. That was a bugger to get going. Ugh. Anyway, that's not what this video is about. I uh, got a pretty special package in the mail today. Mr. Paleoman52 decided to send me a box of goodies and man am I anxious to <laughs> open this up. Paleo man, I think I speak for a lot of people when I say that your talent is only matched by your uh, humility and um, you're, you're an absolute master craftsman and for you to send me a package is pretty special. I want you to know how much I appreciate this. It means a lot. Um, I opened it up here, I see there was a note inside and uh, so I have a pretty good idea what's in here or at least hints of what's in here so I'm probably going to open this up and uh, once I have it all open and have absorbed everything I'll share with you guys what what he sent me but uh, Paleo Man I just want to say thanks again this is uh, quite the treat. Oh can you succeed in leaving me speechless here? Absolutely beautiful I haven't even opened everything yet. <laughs> oh man look at this this is that Burlington shirt spade digger thing that you made. I watched the video when you finished this up. Absolutely awesome. I'm getting a kick out of your letter because you said don't be afraid to use some of this stuff, but that would just be uh, pretty silly. Absolutely. Look, this is art, artwork. Look at this. This is a uh, soapstone from Afghanistan, you told me. I just love working this stuff. I got to work some when uh, uh, Pestle Man sent me some, and I had a blast working this stuff. Super useful. Make tools out of that. Uh, this necklace, guys. This point is so thin. I, I mean, I know your points are thin. I've seen all the vids, but holding it is a different story. Beautiful necklace. Just have to throw that on once in a while. Beautiful. I hope this is picking up. It's kind of dark in here. This is just... Look at this cool little Skinner blade thing. That thing is sharp. That is so nice. <laughs> I don't want to touch this stuff. It's like, man, let alone think about using it. I mean, I don't think a painter uses his canvas as toilet paper. I mean, this is very special. Look at this cool blade. That is useful right there. You could skin a whole animal with that thing. You know, I'm gonna use this to open this last last box. I have something else here too. I just watched a video on this too. This is the Onondaga that you just you just quarried this. And uh, I had this bag open, and I could just tell by looking at this stuff that this is some pretty tough stone. I mean, this would make excellent tools. I don't know if I can open it right now with one hand, but oh, I am so thankful for this. I uh, always he heard about the Onondaga, and I always wanted to like see it up close, hold it. There's a piece right here. That is some tough looking stone. That looks hard. Right there, you could butcher a deer with that. Oh man, thanks so much. I'm, I want to take a couple flakes and see if I smell the oil in this stuff. That is sharp. Holy smokes. Alright, I'm going to open this last box here. Maybe use your Skinner here. And uh, I'll get back with you. I can't do it with one hand. Well, guys, here's what's uh, what was in the uh, that box. Check this out. Onondaga blade. What a beautiful knife. 
Oh, Ken, I love it, man. It's just so nice. That is perfect size. It's right in your hand. Beautiful. This custom sheath to go with it. Oh, man. And what can I say, man? Thank you so much. This is just the definition of overboard and just beautiful, beautiful gift. I want to thank you very much. And I'm definitely going to treasure treasure these things. Absolutely going to treasure them. Oh, Paleo Man succeeded in blowing me away. Thanks so much, and thanks everyone for watching. Take care.